don't miss any content, don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell. Hey guys, welcome back to Sahara Football. As usual, I'm your host, Salas Ifiawe. Today, we're going to talk about the Ghana Black Queen squad that will be taking part in the qualifier. Later on today, they'll be playing in the qualifier, and the lineup is already out. I'll be giving more details on that. The Black Stars B side, that's the Black Meteors. The squad has been named, and Kumasi Asante Kotoko players, as well as Ashgold players who played in the CAF. Champions League and Cup Confederations Cup have been called up to join the squad. They were staying at the Georgia Hotel in Kumasi. They joined the squad later on. I'm giving you a little bit more details on that. And also, Arto Folk have confirmed participation in the match, the President's Cup, on 8th of September. They will be playing. They will be playing Kumasi Asante Kotoko in the President's Cup as well. So if you are new to the channel, I advise you to subscribe to this channel and to click on the notification bell to get more updates. So we all know the Black Queens are preparing for their qualifier game against Gabon in the 2020 Olympic game qualifier and, and the Black Queens coach Messi Tego named an 18 woman squad for this clash. Yes, the match is the match is today later on. By the time this video is uploaded, the match should have started. I'll be taking you through the 18 players as well as the starting 11 for today's game. Now the Black Queens coach Messi Tego has named 18 players for the upcoming assignment against Cabo. Now the former Black Queens player named the team without two of their key players Mukarama Abdullah and Priscilla Adobia for the game against Gabon on Wednesday. This is a qualifier for the 2020 Olympic Games in Tokyo. Before I continue Mukarama Abdullah who was absent in the squad is in, she's in school currently and she could not unfortunately take part in this qualifier. Hopefully they do well without her but the lineup is as follows Fafali, Domasi, Abigail, T. Mensa, Gladys, Amphobia, Anastasia, Achia, Felicity, Aswaku, Rita, Autry, Juliet, Echampong, Justice, Trenebois, Janet, Ejiri, Ellen Coleman, Ophelia, Amponsa, Elizabeth, Ousua, Alice, Kusi, Portia, Boache, Grace, Ahen, Priscilla, Autry, Melet, Pokwa, Grace, Asantoa, so this are the 18 players that will be playing for the Ghana Black Queens in the qualifier against Gabon, which is later on today. The women will be engaging in that. That's a qualifier for the 2020 Olympic Games. Wish them the very best. But this is the starting lineup that will be starting that game later today. The game is set to take place later on today. And, and I, we, 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 we really hope they do well and make it through. Black Queens head coach has named a strong 11 against Gabon this afternoon. The match is at 1.30 p.m. GMT and at the stand Augustine Modern in Libreville. Now the Queens lineup is Fafali, Du Mahasi, Gladys Amphobia, Ellen Coleman, Rich Rita Archery, Janet Ejiri, Juliet Echampon, Alice Kusi, Grace Asantoa, Lizzie Oswa, Portia Boache and Grace Enema. Now the substitutes are Anastasia, Felicity Aswako, Ophelia Amponsa, Melot Pukwa, Presla Autry, Justice Trenebua, Abigail Teria Mensa. So that is the Ghana Black Queen squad that will be facing Gabon later on to this afternoon in the qualifier 2020 olympic games qualifier your predictions for that game are welcome you think they can make it to the 2020 qualifier wish them the very best we hope they beat gabon and make it to the next round of qualifiers so i move on to my next story it has to do with the ghana black stars b team yes the ghana black stars b team we all know are preparing for the 20 chan 2020 which is early next year ghana missed the 2018 edition because they could not qualify now we all know two teams took part in the CAF Champions League and CAF Confederations Cup over the weekend. They are Kumasi Asante Kotoko and also Ashanti Go. Now these two teams had players who were in contention to take part in the Black Meteors team for the qualifier for the Chan 2020. Those players have now been released. We all know the qualifier is very soon and it's, it's a, they, they've been called up eight players most notably Shafiu who scored a hat-trick against Okanangwe FC and Felix Anan, new captain of Kumase Asante Kotoko. Now the Ashanti Go top marksman Shafio Mumuni was invited to the Black Stars B squad hours after hitting a hat-trick against Okanangwe FC in the CAF Confederations Cup return leg 
at your Boise Lengley Sports Stadium. Now, coach of the Black Stars, B. Maxwell Konedu, was also there at Boise to watch Ashanti Gold. Immediately handed the goal, the minus goal poacher, a call up to help prepare for the Ghana's Zone West B Nations Cup championship qualifier against Burkina Faso on September 20th. Shafi was part of the Black Stars B team which held Namibia to a 1-1 draw in an independence anniversary match in Windhoek last year and actually scored Ghana's goal in that game. The Ash Gold skipper reported to camp alongside three of his teammates Latif Anibila, Apia McCarthy and James Akamenko. All the three midfielders featured in coach Ricardo Darocha's team that beat Akanan UFC in the CAF Confederations Cup to make it to the next round of qualifiers. They will face Aris Burkain of Morocco. Now, the Black Stars B are preparing feverishly towards their two legged tie against Burkina Faso, hoping to qualify for the next chance slated for Cameroon between January and February. Ghana failed to qualify for the last chance tournament. By hosted by Morocco in 2018. Meanwhile, Ash Gold and Kotoko will tackle their next opponent of the CAF club competitions in the middle of next month. So that's the latest there on the front of the Black Stars B, the Black Meteors, they call them the Black Stars B team, and they are going to face Burkina Faso in the qualifiers for Chan 20. 20. your thoughts on the comments box felix anan has joined them as well a few of the lads here in your shots taking part in the training session kumasi asante kotoko players were also invited justice blay who was a mammoth he was immense in that game versus kano peles emmanuel jemfi scored a goal richard arthur as well emmanuel ajiman they do as well justice blay as i said were all invited including captain felix anan they are all with the black stars b camp and hopefully they can make ghana proud on this occasion i move on to my next story and it has to do with accra hard to folk versus kumasi asante kotoko we all know accra hard to folk will be playing kumasi asante kotoko in the president's cup the president's cup is slated for 8th of september now there were rumors that accra has a hope might not honor the invitation but they have explicitly stated here that they will be there for the competition now the phobias and porcupine warriors will renew their rivalry in the president's cup next month now the ghana's two biggest club hearts of Oka and kotoko are set for a showdown on september 9th the former have confirmed now the two sides will rekindle their rivalry in an off cup fixture the president cup in honor of the sitting president of the west african nation ghana nana adudankwa akufuadu unlike previous editions mostly hosted in accra this year's fixture is set for kumase at the papayara sports Day. Stadium. The statement read the management of Accra Hard to Folk is pleased to inform our teaming supporters that it has agreed to honor the 2019 President's Cup match against Kumasi Asante Kotoko at the Babayara Sports Stadium on Sunday, September 8th, 2019. Hearts revealed. Now, the game organized by the Ghana League Clubs Association is a match set to return after a year of absence following the Anas expose. Now, the 2017 showdown held in Accra was also contested between Hearts and Kotoko. It ended in a 4 1 victory in a penalty shootout in favor of the Porcupine Warriors. The Phobians and Porcupine Warriors are the two most successful clubs in Ghana League history, winning 22, 23, and 20 trophies between them. That's a total of 43 trophies, Ghana League trophies between them. Who do you think will win this President's Cup this year? 2018 was not held, 2017 Kotoko won it. Can Accra has to hook clinch the President Cup? Will Kumasi Asante Kotoko retain the President's Cup? Your thoughts are welcome in the comment box. So final story and it's about Inter Allies appointing Kwakwesi Fabian once again. Yes, Inter Allies have recalled Kwakwesi Fabian as their new head coach. Now, we all know Kwakwesi Fabian was with Inter Allies before he coached the Ghana under 17 side, took them to the World Cup in India. It wasn't to be, and it was a disappointment of a tournament. We came out of the group but could not progress past that. And also, he was in the Kotoko management team as well head coach of kumasi asante kotoko left kumasi asante kotoko abruptly for better job elsewhere he was also part of the uganda under 17 took them to the under 17 afcon recently 
but it didn't go well for them as well they couldn't make it out of the group stages now Park with Fabian is back with Inter Allies now Inter Allies have announced the reappointment of Park with Fabian as the club new head coach the official statement read that Inter Allies are delighted to announce that Park with Fabian has rejoined the team as head coach the experienced trainer led the 11 to led the 11 is to one to a very decent campaign in the 2014-2015 Ghana Premier League season where they finished sixth. Now Fabian is an outstanding coach who has worked with us before. He's a tremendous leader and strategist. We are happy that he is back, the vice president said. Getting another opportunity to lead the team again, back with Fabian said, I am truly humbled. It was a privilege to serve as head coach during the 2014-2015 season and I look forward to building of the success once again. Fabian is a well-respected coach and somebody we've brought in to help polish our talents to win some sets. To a win some set. We wish him all the best in his second stint with us. So that's the latest appointment there by Inter Allies. They have welcomed back Parquisi Fabian. He was most recently with the Uganda under 17 national team they let him go after disappointment in the AFCON under 17. he is back with entire lives what do you think about that do you think it's a mood move by entire lives to bring him back your thoughts are welcome in the comments box so that has been it for today bringing you the latest on the black queens they will be playing this afternoon against Gabon in the olympic games 2020 qualifier as well as Kumasia Santa Kotoko versus Hatofuk renewing their rivalry in the President's Cup and the Black Stars be preparing in earnest for their qualifier against Burkina Faso on September 20th. I'll see you guys in the next one. Your thoughts are welcome in the comments box. Have a great day.